it's um it's the next day and i'm getting ready to start getting ready for my day it's about nine o'clock now and pretty much today is going to be filled with me working on some LuLaRoe stuff because we got a new box of inventory that I brought here to my house so that I can do a quick live sale today. We got a lot of new really cute leggings and stuff so I'll be doing that at some point today. And then later when Chris gets off of work we're doing this really fun, it's called Fear the Walking Dead Survival experience I guess. It's some new attraction that they're opening downtown and because Chris works with downtown um like the downtown area he's considered friends and family so they have opened that specific attraction to the downtown area employees and stuff for friends and family to come check it out before it's open to the public so that's real exciting i'm excited to do that tonight we were talking yesterday about possibly going to the fright dome this year and my brother was like oh i really want to go to the fright dome and then i was like oh my gosh i want to go too because i haven't been in a few years and if you guys don't know what that is basically out here hold on i have to burp so gross like stuff just comes up randomly when you're pregnant it just happens anyways so basically here at the circus circus casino the circus circus casino let me say that for a third time the circus circus casino there's a adventure dome attached to it which is basically like a mini theme park inside of a giant dome and at halloween time they turn the giant dome into like a haunted house so it's just like a giant haunted house and within within it there's like a bunch of different mazes and it's all blacked out and there's fog everywhere and like scary things that just pop out and scare you and I was talking I was like oh I totally want to go and then both Chris and my brother were like you can't go you're pregnant and I was like well I know I can't go on the rides but why can't I go and just enjoy the the fun scary experience they're like what if they scare you into labor and I'm thinking to myself I'm like crap am I allowed to be scared like I think you can I don't think that that's a problem unless your doctor tells you to like specifically be extra careful with stuff I would assume it's okay to get scared I don't know now I'm like double thinking tonight. I'm like, oh, what if I get really scared and it does something? I doubt it though. So I'm just gonna stop overthinking it. I'm about to go live now in about 10 minutes to show off some new inventory that we got. And since I'm not at my mom's house, it's not like my normal setup. So I have it set up like this, where my lights are over here. I have my inside, my seats are still in here, but that's what's propping up my iPad, which is right here. And then I'll be sitting there and showing off the stuff that's in there and in there. So that's how I've had it set up for myself in order to get it done and it works. So that's what I'm doing. Let's go. We're gonna I'm not going. So Chris just went to get our parking validated because downtown you have to validate your parking. And because he works down here, we get it for free so we don't have to pay for parking. Anyways, we just left the attraction and we did not go on the attraction because when we were sitting in line, there was a sign, like a warning sign, and it said pregnancy. Not, did you get it validated? It said pregnant, if you're pregnant, not to go on the ride so because I didn't know it was an actual ride ride but I guess there's like a motion ride that like yeah. the seats move and stuff we're on the second or the third floor third floor but we didn't want to so we didn't want to risk yeah. anything so we decided to not go on it and just wait until I'm not pregnant and then actually have to buy tickets to do it 
I'm wondering if they got on and then got <laughs> off because I'm talking to a camera. They're like, this girl is weird. We need to get off this elevator. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Dang, people are just all around me. Okay, I'm still gonna wait again. So people look at me funny when I vlog. Anyways, now that we stopped for some gas, I guess I can continue to explain. Basically, I didn't, we didn't, hope you can't hear all the traffic around. We didn't know that the ride was gonna like be a, or the attraction was a ride. And I guess there's some part where there's like a 3D section where you're sitting in a seat and it like, it's like a motion seat. And it said no pregnancy, so we obviously didn't want to take any chances and going on a ride that might possibly do any kind of damage to the pregnancy or to the baby. So we are just now going to go home and probably watch a movie instead. We are back home now and we're just catching up on Outdaughtered or I'm catching up on Outdaughtered. I don't think Chris really cares. He doesn't mind watching it with yeah. me but he uh he just not, I mean it's it's interesting I, to watch. I, I, well that and I like watching things with you so yeah. Yeah. And plus, I was supposed to pick out a movie, but it's getting too late to actually watch a full movie, so I just decided to put on Out Daughter because it was recorded. I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog for today so I can get stuff um, put onto my computer so I'm not too far behind with yesterday's vlog and today's vlog. And I'm not sure if I'm going to vlog tomorrow. We'll see how the day goes, but <sighs> excuse me. I will see you guys in our next vlog. Bye. Aw, oh, man. Why'd you turn it? <laughs> I thought you wanted to do it. No, turn it. Okay, bye. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I just...